A local wild animal sanctuary is calling on Republican gubernatorial candidate John Cox to stop using a live bear at his campaign events and in those TV ads. Perhaps you've seen one of those commercials. Lions, Tigers and Bears founder Bobby Brink made her case this morning at a media conference. And News 8's Allison Royal joining us live with more on her message and how the gubernatorial candidate is responding to it. Allison? Well, good morning, Eric and Netta. So John Cox just wrapped up behind me about half an hour ago and his tour bus will certainly catch your eye if you see it out on the streets. John Cox is running for governor of California again, but this time he has a campaign buddy. It's one of the great symbols of California, a bear named Tag. Now, of course, not everybody is completely on board with Tag, but he says that this bear symbolizes standing up to special interest groups up in Sacramento. Cox wants to take on California's new notorious problem areas, he said, like homeless, homelessness, expensive housing and kids learning on Zoom instead of in person. He criticized Governor Gavin Newsom's policies and the hypocrisy of that French laundry incident up in Northern California, even calling Gavin Newsom a quote pretty boy a handful of times earlier this morning. While some could not bear the excitement, you catch my pun there, others criticized the decision to bring a bear along, saying it's an unhealthy environment for the large animal. Protesters showed up here at Shelter Island earlier shouting quote you do not need a bear for your campaign. Bobby Brink as you mentioned is the founder of Lions Tigers and Bears over in Alpine and she hopes that Cox changes his mind. The reason the bear is here is to demonstrate that we're going to have to be a beast to tackle these special interests. I mean they've had the run of this state for a long time. The conditions in this state are no accident. They exist because interest groups control Sacramento and they like the way things are being run right now. But the rest of the state, the rest of the people don't like it. They don't live a natural life that a bear should live on grass and dirt with caves and rocks and pools or, you know, berries. They're literally in a cage and, tra and trained. It's just, it's sad and it, it, I just don't feel it's the way to win a political campaign. And Brink told us that she invited John Cox and his entire campaign team out to her large animal sanctuary in Alpine for an opportunity to educate them about large animals. And she hopes that he takes her up on that invitation.